Yeah, I really don't want to commit any hate. Heinous, heinous crime. I'm not feeling like I'm in the mood to commit any sort of violent crime right now with this axe. I'm not trying to. Mm. Man, I'm not trying to gripe or grumble tonight, but it's happening. Well, I guess I need to go back upstairs. Let's get back upstairs, guys, and use this rope on something. Hey, everybody. My name is Bleat, and tonight we're playing April 24th. Hope you guys enjoy. Chapter 1, The Wicked. Guys, if this is your first time joining me, I really appreciate you dropping in, checking my channel out, and watching this video. Uh, if this is not your first time joining me, then I appreciate you nonetheless. Thank you for hanging out with me for as long as you have been hanging out with me. Uh, it always means a lot to have you guys check out my stuff, so thank you. Okay, I guess I can't grab that axe, which is kind of unfortunate. All right, I guess I'm just walking into the darkness. So, um, yeah, I appreciate you guys very much. Thank you all so much for joining me. Uh, if you guys, again, are new to the channel, I'm sure you've already figured it out by now. Uh, I mainly do horror games. Um, now this game in particular, I didn't... I don't know much about it. Um, I know... Okay. 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 Um, it looks very similar to some of the other walking simulator games I've played, like September 7th and whatnot. <laughs> And welcome to Kowloon, those types of games. Nope, can't open the door. Okay, back down into the scary basement we go. Um, so yeah, it's a walking simulator type game with a lot of jump scares in it. Um, similar to other games I've played, as I said. And so, uh, hey man, she shouldn't have done that in your bed. She deserves to be punished. Dear Ben, you've been living in the basement for months and haven't come out. You're going crazy and dragging us along. The kids and I don't understand what's going on with you. You become aggressive and you're taking out all your anger on us. Alice is sick. It's hard for her to live in such an environment and Jacob is still too young and I don't want him to get hurt. Know that we have the right to live without you. I tried to discuss everything with you in a normal setting, but you don't make contact. I just want you to know that we have someone who will take care of us. All you have to do is let us go. Let us do this. Sincerely, Evelyn. So I've been in the basement. I've just been living in the basement for months, going crazy. I've got a wife and kids. And they're leaving me. Understandably, obviously I'm a terrible father. Chapter 2, April 24th, 1991. Ooh, how fortunate. So I wonder if we're going back in time. Maybe. Who knows? I'm sure we'll get answers, or maybe not. Um, okay, so... This guy, man. Who's this Who is even this guy? Okay, I'll go up the stairs. Um, but, yeah, I briefly kind of looked at some of the screenshots of this game. It looks a little violent. A little violent. And so, you know, I, I'm all about the horror. I try to walk a pretty... You know, I try to I try to practice some discretion. You know, I'm not trying to play like the most gory games out there, or the most you know, because like as some of you may know, I'm a I'm a Christian, and so I try to you know, you know, I try to not. I don't know. I I, I try to have a line. You know, a line that I don't cross, and it's just it's hard to tell sometimes. Like, you know, with these games, like what and all is in them. So anyway, um. Which the the violence, the violent aspect of it, you know, the the gore and all that stuff doesn't really affect me. You know, it doesn't really bother me. Um, so, cause I'm not, I don't know, I'm not really a, a violent person. <laughs> I don't know. I just it doesn't bother me. And so, you know, but for some people, if it's if it's too much, I definitely understand. But I mean, that's just me assuming. Uh, okay, I guess I'm going to do it. Do what? Is this guy gonna prove my point? This game is very, very violent, which is, which is ironic and also just not great. Just not the best thing that, not what I was actually hoping for. But who knows? Maybe, maybe, maybe it's not. Maybe I'm. Um, maybe do it means to. I don't know. Maybe, maybe go chop down a tree. Maybe that's what he's wanting me to go do. Maybe, maybe. I feel like it's not though. I feel like that's not what I'm supposed to be doing with this axe. Or not what I'm gonna be doing. Oh boy, okay. If there's, okay. Yeah, if there's kids involved, this is a no-go. 
Yeah, this is a no-go for this guy if there's kids involved. That is a hard no from this guy. Oh, I can't interact with these doors. What am I supposed to do? Oh. Yeah. I mean, I should just assume it's a walking simulator, so I'm, I'm probably going to be walking back and forth in the same areas. Uh, okay. Um, I go in here? I do. I do go in here. Yeah, I really don't want to commit any heinous, heinous crime. I'm not feeling like I'm in the mood to commit any sort of violent crime right now with this axe. Like I said, guys, this game might be a little violent. And I'm going to be watching out for it. If it's too much, I don't know. I don't know about it. My name is Sean Miller. I am conducting a journalistic investigation of a brutal murder on the outskirts of the city that occurred on April 24th. I want to find out the true cause of this crime and find answers to all questions. Chapter 3, Observer. Okay, well, okay, I'm glad that we didn't see it. You know, because I'm like, yeah. And especially if there's kids, you know, there's kids involved. I'm like, yeah, okay, you know, it's just, it's not my thing. It's not my jam. It's not my, not my jams. I think that's just, you know, maybe, maybe, maybe bleat from two years ago before he had a baby, but now with the, with the son, I can't, I just can't. But probably not even then, because I feel like I'm just, I try to be a decent guy and just, you know, kids and games like this, I'm just, eh, you know, it's just not, not, not it, not it for me. All right, I, what am I supposed to do? This isn't turning on. This looks like I should be able to click it. I really enjoy doing this. You know, not this, not necessarily this, where I'm not really figuring out what to do, but I do enjoy playing these games very much. And I, I love the fact that, you know, for some of you guys, you guys have tagged along with me and um, have supported my channel just by popping in and commenting and liking and sharing and all that good stuff. Not that I even asked for it because, I don't know, in my opinion, if you, if you like my videos, then we'll do those things. And if you like my videos and you don't do those things, that's fine. You know, it's it's all right. Um, that is okay. Um, but yeah, all that really helps out my channel a lot. All the likes and comments and all that stuff and and shares and stuff and and watch time. You know, that's a big one. But um, so for all of you guys who have consistently done those things, it means a lot. So thanks. That's all I had to say. And I hope you guys are doing well. I really do. I've said that before. I've said it a lot. I've even said it in this video of like two minutes ago. But I mean it. I really do mean it. <laughs> oh, it's the drawer. Yeah, that was subtle. That's subtle. Okay. All right. On April 24th, a brutal murder took place in a house on the outskirts of the city. A man killed his entire family with an axe. The accused himself called the police and was arrested on the spot. The man testifies and says that he was influenced by a certain man in a hat and that he forced him to commit his crime. This crime. Police have no further comment. We will monitor developments in this case. All right. Let's close that back because we are not animals here. We pick up after ourselves and we watch TV, right? Is that what we do? We turn on the television? No, we don't. Okay, we leave. That's the only other option, right? Nope, that's not it either. Is it not? Are you sure it's not the TV? Oh, here we go. Pieces of me. Take. All right, now we're on to something. Now we're, now we're figuring it out. Insert. All right. I hope this doesn't show the murder. You know, I hope it doesn't show me. Okay, chapter four, pieces of me. I hope, yeah. I hope, okay. I'm holding the lighter and not the axe, so that's a good sign. All right. Also, I really wish that I could change the sensitivity of my, like, the look sensitivity, but I can't. It feels very kind of slow in a way. I don't know. That's just a minor gripe. I'm not trying to gripe. <clears throat> Man, I'm not trying to gripe or grumble tonight, but it's happening. You know, I would love to see if I could get through one of these games without jumping or hollering, or hooting and hollering, but I don't think that, that that's even possible. Cause I'm really not, I need to look for a knife. I'm not a, I'm not a scaredy cat. You know, I feel like I, I feel like, okay. Yeah, I'm not a scaredy cat, you know? I feel like I'm pretty uh, brave. Is that the word? That's the word, that's that's the word, right? Cour courageous? I don't know. But I also feel like um, I jump a lot, and I say, hey, here's a knife, and I scream a lot. And it's out of 
And guys, when I tell you this, I I genuinely mean it. Whenever I scream and stuff, it is it is authentic. It is authentic. I I really don't I don't try to carry on like a lot of other people do that I've seen play these games, and they're they're freaking out. You know, you can tell when it's exaggerated. Um, it's it's genuine. Whenever I whenever I'm uh, scared, actually scared. I feel like that's you know, I feel like that's that goes without saying. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever, doesn't matter. Let's just keep playing the game. All right. Um. So I guess is it flashing back and forth between like? Is this like post murder or pre murder? What is this? Okay. All right. All righty. Uh, who knows? And we'll probably never get answers, but that's okay. Okay. This is messed up. Oh, wait. Handprint. What does that mean? Oh, I can move it. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Wait. Okay. All right. We are making some progress here. I don't know, guys. I honestly don't know what it is. I mean, the game's kind of scary. It is. It is a scary. It is a scary game already. Um, but I am just extra jumpy tonight. Sometimes I'm not. Sometimes I'm not. But tonight I am. Tonight I am. That's okay. We'll get through it. I'm not scared. You know, I'm not scared. I am not scared of this game, or anything in this game, or anything at all. Um, I can tell what's gonna happen here. Cause I'm a, I'm a veteran, not really. I, I played enough of these games though that I know what's gonna happen. I feel like I know what's gonna happen. <sighs> yeah, yep. That's about what I was thinking. Yeah, uh, man, I'll tell you what. I honestly, okay, so this is just kind of a random thought, but I'm just, as you guys may or may not know, I do tend to talk a decent bit whenever I'm a little bit nervous. It helps me get through these games, it truly does. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna talk, and I'm sorry if you guys don't like it, but I'm just gonna start saying things, and I'm gonna try to not just babble. I'm gonna like I am now. I'm gonna try to actually say things that are meaningful. Um, so what I was gonna say is, uh, oh, okay. Why not now? I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't. I don't think that's a good idea to do that now. I don't. I wouldn't do that. That's not what I would do in this situation. But we're doing. It. We're doing it anyway. Um, honestly, guys, okay, so what I was gonna say is that I. Oh, that's close. Oh, that's very close. That's in the room with me. I can tell. I can tell by. Yep. 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 Hello, miss. Okay, not bad. Not too bad. Um,. Yeah, what I was gonna say is I sometimes I wish that I was streaming you guys have mentioned it a few times like do I stream and you know would I stream and honestly like I think I would really enjoy streaming I do but I feel like with streaming I got to be very consistent and I try to be consistent here but you know like I don't know and then honestly, there's the thing of like, if I even start streaming, you know, there'd be like two viewers and am I gonna get discouraged and this, that and the other and, but, um, but anyway, um, I, I do think a really cool thing, uh, something I would really enjoy about streaming is just to be able to talk to you guys in real time. Because I always love commenting or, you know, responding to y'all's comments and stuff and talking with you guys. Um, so it would be really fun, I think, to, just chat with you guys. What was that? What was that sound? Um, yeah, that'd be a lot of fun. I do think it'd be a lot of fun. But, you know, we'll see. Maybe, maybe at some point in the future. I don't know. Um, I don't think I'm supposed to be back here. I think I'm supposed to... Oh. Wait. Wait. That, yeah, I came from here, so this... This is different. Um, yeah, but maybe sometime in the future. I don't know. We'll see. 
it's just right now like I've kind of really gotten the the rhythm down of just recording and stuff there is definitely something in that coffin I can see it through the crack all right let me guess I'm just gonna wander around this coffin until the coffin door opens and then something's gonna come crawl oh wait wait no maybe not okay well I'm wrong and I'm very happy that I am because I would not want anything to come out of that coffin I would prefer that coffin stay shut um what was I saying doesn't matter let's answer let's answer this phone doesn't matter hello hello uh some shelves is that a rope and uh something in a box okay well I feel like there's Nope, never mind. I thought something was gonna be behind me. That's that I feel like that's gonna be in the basement. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. Let's go this way then. If let's not let's not go that way. Oh, fantastic. Alright. Well, we should have seen that. We did see that coming, honestly. We, we knew that was gonna happen. We knew that coffin wasn't gonna stay shut forever. That's okay though. They might, they might be a friend. Whoever was in that coffin, they may, they might be a friend. They might be nice. Uh, okay, all right. Okay. All right, uh, okay, I can't go this way, so I gotta go this way. So I'm looking for the sh- oh, here we go. This is it, right? This is what I need. I need rope. I need myself some rope, and she's gonna be gone. Not quite. Not quite gone. Still here. All right, that's okay. That's okay, I'm not really worried about it. Um. Um, okay. Well, I guess I need to go back upstairs. Let's get back upstairs, guys, and use this rope on something. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yep. Let's just keep on. Let's just keep on. Let's just keep on keeping on. I'm starting to sweat. <laughs> I am starting to sweat a little bit. What am I using this rope for? What am I tie the ropes to the doors? Okay. We'll do. Shockingly, that one did not get me. That one did not get me at all, actually. Alright. Those okay, close the board cl close and board up the coffin. Okay. Let's hammer down these nails with our hand. Or our lighter. Okay. Here we go. Need to find a cross and put it on the coffin. Well, wasn't there a cross back this way? Oh, here we go. Uh, okay, bookshelf. Okay, so there's a book. There's a secret book. Oh, it's above me. Okay. The safe is open. Oh, in the kitchen. Okay. All right. I feel like it's about, <laughs> about time for another jump scare is what I was going to say. I feel like it's about time for another jump scare. And there we go. There it is. Here's the cross. Alrighty. Let's go put this on the <laughs> Please, kid. Please, please, please. You're going to have to try harder than that. Okay. I don't know who you think you're messing with, but I don't jump that easy. I actually do. I jump very easily. All right. You're gonna die. I got news for you, sis. In the end, we're all gonna die. <laughs> Chapter five: The Touch of Evil. And we are blowing through this game. We are making strides. All right. Okay. Okay, so I can't leave. Need to lock the door with a chair. Oh. Okay. Okay. Hey, buddy. 
Hello, buddy. Proof of death. What? Let's see what it is. Let's see what this tape shows. Huh. So, wait. Am I... So, am I... Okay, so I feel like I kind of know what's going on now. And it only took us chapter six. My gosh. Okay. So, I guess this is the crime scene. Yep, that's pretty graphic. All right. We are gonna... We're just gonna proceed here. All right. I need bolt cutters, apparently, to get through that. I was about to say something, and I completely forgot what I was gonna say. And... Um... Okay. Um... Yeah, I don't know. It'll come to me eventually, I guess, but... Oh! Oh! There we go. That's what we need. Wow, surprisingly not bolt cutters, but a saw. A hand saw. Alright. Uh, oh yeah. I was gonna say... I think I figured out what's going on. I think that in that room where I'm putting the tapes in the TV. I feel like maybe that's, is that like a detective who's found the the tapes of like the, the well no that's not right because, because I'm watching the tape and it says crime scene. I don't know what's going on. Who knows? I can open this door with a bolt cutter. Ah, there it is. There's our bolt cutters. What are these games without, without a good old fashioned pair of bolt cutters, you know? Always need a good pair of bolt cutters in these games. Always. And let me guess. I need to find the password. Bolt cutters are going to be in the safe. Got to find the password. Uh, alright. Hmm. Okay. Here's a three, and that's over a C. So maybe we're looking for, for A, B, C, D. Does that sound reasonable? Does that sound logical? Maybe. Oh, here we go. B is... Alright, 3B. Okay. So we need A. Wherever A might be. Nothing over here. So maybe the last two... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Here we go. Okay, so 5 is D. Okay, so we found B, C, and D. So it's 3, 3, 5. But we gotta find A. Maybe it's in here. Yeah, it is in here. 4. All right, four, three, three, five. Enter. Okay, here we go. A note. What does it say? Dear Ben, I can't live like this anymore. I want to get a divorce and sell the house. My torment has become unbearable and I need freedom. Please give me the opportunity to start a new chapter in my life. Sincerely, Evelyn. Uh, thanks, pal. I'll take that from you. All right, well, there's the key that opens the lock that gives me access... Gives me access to the bolt... To the bolt cutters. Okay. Oh, wait, no. This way, right? Right? Yeah, in here. Okay. And then in here. Okay. And then um in here. Man, we are we are going we are blowing through blowing through this game. I gotta say, I am proud of us. Alright. There's something behind the door. Need to find something to open it with. All right. Ah, uh, here we go. This is it. This is the move. Let's use these bolt cutters. All right. Wait, can't use the bolt cutter. Wait, maybe, do I have to go back? I think I have to go back. I feel like I have to go back. Mm-hmm. Unfazed, like, like very much so unfazed. You're gonna have to try a lot harder than that. Tons harder to get me. They happening. Alright, guys. Here we go. Crowbar. What more could we ask for? Alright. I will 
I will say these walking simulator games they're pretty good I do enjoy them um, uh, I do enjoy them they honestly though they're they're mostly just uh, you know wait here we go um obviously the, the whole idea of these games is just atmosphere and jump scares which is good which is good um, but uh, if you guys um, have any other recommendations, uh, what, I'm, what I'm getting at is this, is these games are usually very, very realistic looking, you know? They look really well, they look really good. And so if there's other games that look good that you guys want to watch me play, let me know. Let me know, because I will happily look at them. Even if I don't play them, I'll still look at them. Gosh. Okay, where where am I taking this? Hello, miss. Am I taking this back this way? Maybe. I don't know what I'm doing with this axe, but we will figure it out. Oh, man. Chapter 7, there's no way out. <sighs> Alright. There's no way out. It's your turn to make a movie. Okay. Enough of the shenanigans. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I feel like my resilience level has just skyrocketed. None of these jump scares are getting me anymore. I've just, I've become numb. I've become numb. Do it. Okay, I feel like I know where this is going. I'm just gonna keep walking around this table. Finish your movie. Get on the chair. Oh, man. What if I don't want to get on the chair? I've completed this investigation, but unfortunately I will not be able to publish it. This house is a source of madness. It has consumed me. I wanted to find the truth, but instead I found death. It's all about the man in the hat. He oppresses his victims and makes them do terrible things. Ben recorded everything on tapes. I saw that man forcing Ben to kill his wife for cheating, but it wasn't enough for him. He continued to stalk him until Ben killed his entire family. Now I'm his next victim and I can't stand up to him. Sean Miller. So you're just gonna take the easy way out? Man, come on. What a weenie. All right, well, I guess for the sake of finishing the game, let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and get on with it. <laughs> guys, thank you all so much for joining me for my playthrough of April 24th. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope to see you all in the next video. Until then, take care.